We are Dee and Allie. Come along and join us aboard Journey. Oh, oh yeah, seasons change. No promise of tomorrow, but that's okay. Just live in the moment day by day. We arrive in Beaufort, North Carolina several days before the Memorial Day weekend to get a spot to anchor. But it was already crowded, and we actually had to move three times before we found our happy place. We did end up close to the Rachel Carson Preserve in Taylor's Creek. Almost in too shallow water, but not as shallow as some found, as you will see. This was a full anchorage that continued to grow to around 25 boats, mostly sailing catamarans, so they took up lots of room. The ferry boats did not like all the boats in the anchorage and would sometimes blast through all the anchored boats. But of course, when I was recording, he was behaving. Not kidding. Right down the channel? Yes, so he can use the channel. He has been choosing all day not to use the channel. Even passing the pirate ship. Yep. Who uses the channel? Whom I was recording because they're having a party out there on the pirate ship. But let's watch Papa George dock. He'll probably still need to cut through the anchorage right here because he is unhappy with these boats. We enjoyed exploring the waterfront here in Beaufort. So many old homes with stories that we enjoyed reading about on our walks. A beer at the Fishtown Brewery was great, but our favorite little spot was the Port James Cafe. Check out that chalkboard and the prices. We wandered through a local museum, mostly about Blackbeard, and bought our new pirate flag. After visiting the local farmer's market, we found the old burying ground and spent some time exploring the history in the cemetery. While on shore, we got some great shots of Journey. Most of Memorial Day weekend, we spent on our front deck. And one of my favorite things was watching the pirate ship cruise that so many tourists to Beaufort enjoyed. It looked like those guys were having lots of fun. Part of the pirate ship fun was the little scallywag that followed the big boat around, and I'm sure was somehow part of the act. Sunday morning was dreary, and we woke to boats around us stuck on bottom. Thankfully, we had stayed just shy of the shallows. Blown away was one of the not-so-lucky boats. We watched this boat all weekend. They anchor really close to us. And now they're YouTubers. Even they have a pretty big following. Uh, but right now they're sitting on bottom. And again, you know, we're really close to them. But they're not going anywhere for a while. Memorial Day weekend came and went with beautiful sunsets each night we were here. We had heard and read about the wild horses on the island, the Rachel Carson Preserve, but we had not seen any from the boat yet, so we needed to do some exploring. We started at the little beach closest to us, but this is also where the ferry drops tourists for the day, so as expected, we saw signs of horses, but no horses, but we did enjoy the hike and the scenery of the preserve. Once again, we got some great shots of Journey with Beaufort in the background.
After reading about the preserve and doing some investigating and research of Google Maps, I was pretty sure there was a walkway further up Taylor Creek where we could try and see if we could find some horses. So we took Shelby up the creek, catching a few sights, and then finally horses along the shore, even before we found the walkway. Finally, we see the walkway and we find a place for Shelly. And since it was low tide, when we start into the preserve, we catch sight of the ground moving. Check it out. And of course, this bird did not want to be left out. As we make our way out the boardwalk, we find a stunning view of horses with the ocean in the background. On our way back down the creek, we see some interesting sights and in our stay with a spectacular sunset. It's finally time to head to New Bern and our final destination for the next six months. The horses decided to show themselves from the shore as we left this morning. Beaufort was a great stop, but New Bern, here we come. Living in the moment, capturing enjoyment. Oh, we are living in the moment, life full enjoyment. 